Here we have um, our vacuum solenoids again, um, and we're going to, I'm just going to demonstrate Mac, min max again here. But this time, uh, we're going to use uh, the current. We're going to check uh, the current min max, minimum and maximum current. Here we have our meter again, and you can see the min max. I already have it connected up for current. And that means the meter is connected in series. That means the power comes from the power supply goes into the digital multimeter through the digital multimeter out of the digital multimeter and into into the component and out of the component and back to the power supply again um, and just your meter connections the way it's set up there the com jack is connected in the blackware is connected into com jack and I've connected on the red lead onto the amps jack. Um, normally, unless you're sure what current you're um, going to be measuring, you should set it at, a at the highest level first. So we put on the amp scale there. And here we have the dial set to, as you can see there on the, um, starting on the right hand side, and the bottom symbol on the right hand corner there is, is uh, that little U with a little leg on it to the left of it, and A. Um, that stands for microamps, that's a millionth of an amp, that's one amp divided into a million pieces. Um, so you're talking about a very small amount of current there. Although the, uh, microamps are not the smallest units, you can go down um, even even lower than that. Um, but normally the microamps will be the lowest you'll need to know about. So then the one that we've the meter set to um, is, is a we well, expect to be measuring milliamps, so you have amps, both amps and milliamps there, and you can see the little um, signature mark directly over the MA, and that stands for alternating. So we're actually measuring direct current um, in this case, and you can see the little bar with the three little dots underneath it um, in yellow to the right hand side of that symbol there. And when we we want to measure DC, that's a DC symbol. We want to measure DC. We just go over here, and that yellow button we have to press that, and that will bring that. That will bring us on then to um, uh, milliamps uh, in DC, which is battery current. Right, I'm just going to focus then on the meter, and I'm just going to demonstrate again the minimum maximum current there. At the moment, I have that that solenoid is actually drawing 265 milliamps. Um, right. Going to change. I'm just going to make an alteration. On uh, oh yeah, sorry. You just press the min max button. Then when you have your when you have your current up, just press your press your min max. See the min max there again. And if I alter the settings, you can see there she's changing up and down. Now she's gone to zero. Right, and back on to two seventy six there again. I'll just, I'll just alter this so that it doesn't uh, go to zero completely. Oops, she's gone to zero there again. check to see what the minimum was. The minimum was zero there because you cut it completely. So if you happen to wiggle your wires and um, you got an open circuit there to go to zero amps. So that's uh, that's again that's the beauty of this setting. Um, you can see the minimum there cut, it went to zero so you know that you had an open circuit. Um, so that's that's actually displaying the average value there at the moment 219 milliamps. That's the current setting, 244. Maximum is 285 milliamps. Minimum is 0 amps.